Hey guys, how's it going? It's X666X Iron Maiden. Today, we're back with more Nightwish. This is the eyes of Sharbat Gula. Alright, so. This one is another one from Endless Forums Most Beautiful. You can tell that this was around the time where in one video I asked uh, to request some, to, to, you know, basically I said I wasn't getting a lot of requests from this album, and then I just got basically the whole album <laughs> requested and all went on the list roughly at the same time. I think that's why it's all basically bunched together. Uh, so, uh, let's jump in, check it out. So far, everything on this album's been good to me. M most Night Wish has been good to me. Buffer. That's annoying. I hate when it does that. It's rare, but it doesn't. It's a cool intro so far. This album seems to have like a lot of these. There's a few chill intros on here. I shouldn't say a lot, but there's been a few. Again, I'm liking how the intro is going, and it's ever so slightly building. Is that Troy? It doesn't really sound like Marco. That is quite the build up in this song. You can tell it's coming, it's coming though. It's getting there. think it is. It's going to climax at some point. Even if it doesn't go all out in this track, it's going to be a climax. That's just Nightwish. Another really nice touch, man. Just layers. Just layers of different sounds throughout this song. Keeping with that main beat. It feels like a movie soundtrack, like something building up to something in a movie.
building up a little bit more. So, I guess it's not gonna just explode out into like full on epic. You know what I mean? If you know what I mean by full on epic. It's still cool though. Wow. This album is just a beautiful album, man. Just in general, it's just a beautiful album. All the songs on it just come off as beautiful. Um, and that was that was six minutes. You know what I mean? Like it, it's uh, it, it's it's cool to have a, a song that's that long and it just be basic. I, I don't know where it sits on the album. Maybe I can find out here. Um, that's the build up to the greatest show on earth. So yeah. Uh, <laughs> That's, uh, that's, uh, it makes sense if it, it feels like an in-between track. I think that's between Up, Up and Glow, which we just did, uh, the other day. Hey, we've done most of this album now, now that I'm looking at the, the list from the album. We've pretty much done the whole album now. There's only, a, uh, what, like, I think there's only one, maybe two songs we haven't done from this one. But I'll, it goes Up and Glow into this song, into The Greatest Show on Earth, which is a nice combo with Alvin Glow, you know, bringing in the lyric, We Were Here, that you hear again, The Greatest Show on Earth, and it's kind of like a buffer in between uh, this instrumental track, and then kicks into that. That's, uh, that's interesting, I like that. The song was like, uh, yeah, it, just, it was like a really, really cool intermission that, like, you would listen to on its own, basically. At least that's how it, it felt to me. I would listen to it on its own, I would never skip that track in between those two, it's just a really really nice, chill puts you in this chill mindset uh, with all the melodies and, and all that going on in there and the different elements it was, it was really cool and uh, I'm glad that uh, someone requested to check this one out even though it was just instrumental I, I know that I know Anne brought it up like a couple weeks ago um, to ask if I'd already had it on the list, which I did uh, so that was good, but if I wouldn't at least and knew that I would probably like this anyway, so. Anyway. The dog's chewing on bone behind me. Sorry if you can hear that. Anyway, if you guys enjoyed, make sure you hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe to see more from me. And as always, you guys have a good one. I'll catch you later.